As I was saying, this channel is not for children. If you have a YouTube app that is for kids, use your app. This is an adult channel only. Parents will not find this very suitable for any child under the age of 14. So if you are a child, please do not watch my stuff. Hello YouTubers, dudes, dudettes, my name's Adam. I'm here to uh, show you another mystery box opening for spastic collectibles. Um, this one here is three of the $15, the Grape Hunt for Toucan Sam and one $25 box of pops. Uh, I believe the $25 box of pops was six random pops, maybe chases are exclusives. But the $15 ones, you have a possibility of getting the old Toucan Sam, not the one that everyone, you know, was spending $800 on eBay just recently for the metallic one. So this is the older one, which is honestly cool. And if I get it, that's great. I will probably do a dance. Um, so if you want to see a man dance, stay tuned. Possibly I might dance. Possibly I won't. I don't know yet. Um, so yeah, it's a pretty big box. Uh, but before I begin, I just wanted to give a shout out to Mystery Pop Theater. Um, for real, uh, great constructive feedback. Funko Queen. Um, and we don't give a pop. I mean, I've been talking with them on Instagram. Uh, Mystery Pop Theater uh, has been giving comments and likes on the videos. So I do appreciate that, for real. Um, it, it, it's, it's very cool to hear some feedback from another YouTuber uh, that actually does a lot of videos and, um, you know, has a lot of great content. Um... So yeah, I'll be reaching out to him in a little bit, and uh, hopefully we'll get something going. Um, so let's let's begin. And today, uh, instead of killing myself with huge scissors, uh, which I'm gonna use the small scissors. So um, yeah, let's do this. And by the way, if you did like the uh, skit in the beginning, uh, let me know, because I'll do some more of those. And for those that aren't familiar, that's uh, kind of, well, it's definitely taken from older Saturday Night Live. I don't know when I like go, uh, you know, piece by piece, uh, modern age, uh, I actually brought it up too. So anyways, so uh, yeah, I'm just going to throw this order down and then a uh, Spassy Pop sticker. Have one up there. Uh, I'm going to put that up there again. Good. Uh, Bubble wrap, great, great stuff. One time. All right. So let's start with the three Toucan Sam mystery boxes first. Or the hunt for the Toucan. Cool. Uh, I believe the numbers are, yes, I got 99. I got 86, and I also got 69. I just picked the numbers randomly. At first I was trying to order a bunch. Um, well, I just put three on there, and then it said sold out, and then I reached out to Spastic Collectibles, like, hey, what's going on? He's like, oh, you gotta pick one number. And I'm like, oh, I'm an idiot. So I just picked random numbers. No relevance in what these meanings are. Um, so here we go. Let's start with 69 first. Alright, let's take a look. Ashley 2 
from Black Mirror. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I watched Black Mirror. This is uh, the Black Mirror with Miley Cyrus. Um, it's her Ashley doll. And uh, if I could recall, the Ashley doll was, um, it's like Furbies. You remember Furbies, the creepy dolls that became de demonic and would say random things in the middle of the night and talk Satan slang to you. So uh, you woke up with more nightmares if you had nightmares um, in the beginning. So yeah, this is nice. I honestly, like I've said before, I'm not in it for like selling or, I mean, maybe eventually I'll trade, but I'm just going to keep all the pops that I get for now, unless they're duplicates, I'll, I'll definitely sell them. But honestly, the box, there's no like box damage that I could, I could see. Let me just give it a little look-see over. Oh, looks pretty good. So yeah, this is the Ashley 2 from Black Mirror. So cool. Didn't know this existed, but now I do. Awesome. Uh, the next we'll go with uh, 86. Let's cut this guy open. Cool. Take a look. I'm telling you, if I get something good, I'm going to dance. I'm going to let you know. Just be prepared. What is this? James Gordon. I've seen this one. This is from Gotham. This one's been gotten a lot. Uh, so, it's not James Corden, the... Uh, uh, talk show hosts. This is James Gordon, which I believe is, you know, the person that Batman talks to later on in the series. Uh, the lead investigator later on. So this is, I haven't watched the, the Gotham series. Um, uh, I think it's Fox. Um, so I don't really know too much about it. I, I know about Batman, but not about the younger characters. I know Batman's like the teenagers or something, which is probably... 14 and above, which that's what you are in this channel, because not for kids. Anyways, a um, little bit of box damage, but whatever. I'm definitely going to keep this, because, like I said, there's no pops that I don't collect. I mean, the Fortnite ones, not a big fan of, but hey, I'll give those to my nephews. Uh, this last one is 99, so maybe lucky number 99 has uh, some stuff in their cards for us, or for myself. And for you to see me dance, if it is that you can. Be crazy, but here we go. What is it? This is uh, from Big. Uh, this is um, Josh Baskin, which um, is the counterpart of Tom Hanks in the movie. It's his friend that when uh, Tom Hanks grows older, he walks around with his friend. I actually have the Zoltar uh, figure for this, so... Hey, no complaints. Yeah, so all I guess I need is uh, the kid, Josh Baskin. So, hold on. Maybe Josh Baskin is Tom Hanks. I don't know. It's one of them. Uh, I know Tom Hanks is in it, and he grows up, and, you know, he gets the apartment and does the piano scene where he's dancing, you know, on the piano and makes the cool music. And, yeah, and this is a Target, I guess, exclusive. Box is not terrible. So I guess there's no dancing from this guy. So... Let's move on to the box of pops. Pretty big. I'm just reading the warning of this. All right, here we go. Box of pops. What could this box of pops be? Someday I'll get a grail. Someday. Okay, so I am cutting slowly. I understand. I did cut towards myself, but that's fine. All right, and last but not least, the side. Come on, guy. Here we go. So, box o pops. So, uh, okay. All right, so there should be six in there. Uh, I mean, they all feel like no cases, but I don't know what that means. But I'm just going to start with pulling one out. And uh, actually, I don't really know the prices of them. I'm just going to set them down and pull them out. Yeah, so definitely don't see any soft cases. I'll just do this. Alright, so let's start with this one. So this is uh, Frozone, uh, which is from The Incredibles. I don't collect them, but like I said before, I'm going to keep them. Unless you really, really want this one, let me know. Um, 
all the prices I will put up later on the screen, like I have been doing in other videos. Uh, this next one is Hulk, uh, Thor Ragnarok. So, um, I don't know if I have this one. I might somewhere, but if not, that's cool too. Box shape is good. Cool. The next one we got is the Last Girl. This is from The Incredible 2. Also. Box is in good shape. This is a, a Target exclusive, I believe. Well, it says only at Target, so I am corrected myself. Cool. The next one after that is Thanos Infinity War. Exclusive only at Target. So I believe these uh, the box of pop was guaranteed value. Uh, I paid $25 for it, so I should get $25 back. Uh, honestly, if not, whatever. It is what it is. And uh, hey, I, I like the speed of spat spat collectibles and how they deliver everything really, really, really fast. No complaints there. I will hit a grail someday. Uh, the next one is uh, Guillermo del Toro, which is... Yeah, famous director. Um, I like the number 666. That's awesome. He does horror movies. Um, does a bunch of horror movies. I think the one that comes to mind, I, I know there's a ton and I've watched a ton, is like the Green... Not Green Lantern. It's something like in the woods. I don't know. I'll correct myself later, but here, here we go. Box shape is pretty decent. I don't see any, you know, bad things going on with this one. Cool. And the last but not least of this box is Abity Mall, which is in from Infinity Wars. So, hey, I might get the whole collection here soon. I have Hulkbuster. So yeah, that's that's that guy. Cool. Box is in a, in great shape. I mean, this one just has a little bit of a, a cut, but I mean, whatever. It is what it is. And uh, yeah. So, yeah, that's the box of pops from Spastic Collectibles, and um, just a little uh, upcoming uh, videos that I'm going to have to create and stuff. Um, I'll be doing the, there's a blind box hunt um, for Freddy Funko, which is $80, uh, two pops uh, per box, guaranteed value, um, and I'll put a picture of that when I do it, so for now, I'm not going to do that. I also have... Um, the Teenage Mutant Tur Ninja Turtles, I think the box was $100 uh, from Spastic Collectibles. Um, that should be coming in. Well, it's already here. I just haven't done the video yet. Um, then I have the Chalice Collectibles, which was the Black Friday. Just taking a lot of time. It's supposed to be here on Saturday, but let's see if it arrives. That's That would be great. Uh, then I have three boxes from Tough Collectibles. That should be coming, hopefully. I got an email, so we'll see about that. Um, there's the Black Friday mystery box, uh, the Grail Hunters mystery box, and the Cyber Monday mystery box. All of these boxes were $30. And ordered a little bit ago, and say they, I got an email that says they're on the way. So, um, and I also have a seven bucks a pop video that I just filmed, but I wanted to do this one first. Um, so yeah, stay tuned and uh, hope you're doing well and enjoying your uh, early morning Saturday or whatever time of day it is for you. Um, be positive, care for each other, and you know, just another quick shout out to Mystery Pop Theater uh, for real. Uh, thanks for the the feedback on on the comments. Like you're the only one. Well, there's a couple others uh, which I I'll read next time, but, uh, for you, uh, you've been commenting the most and, and replying back. So I definitely appreciate it. Um, as always is, uh, great to get feedback from other YouTubers that do this on a, a regular. So, um, oh yeah, one more, more thing, uh, with your filming equipment, not filming equipment, lighting equipment, just make sure you don't drop it or this will happen. So yeah, this has been Adam learning moment maybe, and, uh, have a good one.